Hello. Hello and and welcome to Minecraft, uh, the GPL survival multiplayer server. I am doing this for one reason and one reason only. I feel like it, so go deal with it. Um, yeah, that's really just the extent of things. <sighs> so, my apologies for rec for only starting this recording after I had already made a little bit of progress. You can look a little closely, there are a bunch of other people on the server, four others, Pineapple, Wylander, Cyanide Express, and Baby Eric. Looking even more closely at like this right region of the chat box, you can see I'm holding a pickaxe. That's a stone pickaxe, not iron. It looks like iron, but it's not iron. There are these people in the nether, and that that is my goal. My goal is I want to go to the nether. I want to just build a house there, get some nether wart, camp out, and uh, just basically brew a lot of potions. That is my goal. I like to be able to brew potions, especially because, like, for me, fire, I'm bad at PvP and video games, and I do this on a trackpad, so fire resistance potions are how I kill blazes, which is how I brew more potions. So, if I can find some, some magma cream and stuff, then I will be a happy little guy. I just need to make sure everything's going nicely, and everything is. So, most everything I have, I just have on me. I've got a couple of stone tools, some low-level materials. But yeah, my username, I am Sensei Fire. Super bad cat equals Sensei Fire equals me. And that's just sort of the the way the news goes. I admittedly made this Minecraft account a very long time ago before Super Bad Cat was a thing. And back when I was still small child with like very edgy mannerisms. So I suppose there's that. Gonna steal this man's bed? Okay. So my hope for right now is just, uh, are things gonna be good? This is probably not going to be a very long episode, but I also don't know how long these episodes are going to be anyway. Regardless, I'm just, I'm just chillin'. This first episode, my first little time here, I am very much looking for lava. Because if I find lava, and perhaps a bit more iron, but mostly lava, then I can make my nether portal, start building a little cobblestone hut with the portal inside of it, and I can just start looking for a fortress, setting up shop, really. And being who I want to be, which is the Nether Nomad. Hidden in the depths. What the hell is hidden in the depths? Uh, obtain ancient debris. Okay, I'm back. They're actually hunting for ancient debris because they want armor because they're gonna get involved in conflicts. Bah! I, I don't I don't need netherite stuff, I don't think, because I, I already know that I'm bad at PvP. <laughs> so I'm not even going to try. They can fight their wars. I'm going to be a nomad in the midst of all of it. So, um, as for my current items, it's kind of night out. But as for my current items, you can see I've got a decent haul. It's still got a lot of mutton that I need to s Oh, wait, that reminds me. I can I can go and smelt some food. That's what I can do with this time. So, half of this. And, like, some of this. 
and then this and this. So yeah, that's 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 what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be smelting that. Slain by Piglin Brute. Look at the lad. Being a lad, but yeah. Oh my gosh, everybody is spontaneously combusting, and I'm just here mining away. So I suppose pretty fun thing about a Minecraft series like this, because yes, this is going to become a series, it's not just a one-off thing, is I can sort of just talk about whatever the hell I want. I talked with these people earlier asking, is this going to be an entire, like, uh, socio-political simulation? And they were like, what the fuck are you talking about? But yes, it is. I say socio-political... Uh, I say socio-political simulation in a manner that's basically just saying yeah we're, we're gonna have factions we're gonna like fight a bunch of nerds so right now i'm working on getting some cobblestone because nether ghasts i don't want to die or get my portal blown up what is this oh that's a cave piss and shit So, it's, it's good to know that there's a cave there. I still have my crafting table on me. I just need to place it. Okay, move that there. Just going to place it so that I can... I, I need to build myself some more... Some more tools. That's kind of what I need to do. So I'm going to make... A few stone pickaxes. Yep, that seems good. Check on my mutton and coal. Take my mutton and coal. I'm, I'm burning more coal than I need to, and I'm usually very conservative with these sorts of resources and supplies. I'm just going to see how much of that uh, beef can get smelted. Is it daytime? Whoop. Yep, that, 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 that skeleton saw me. He's dead. He's done the bud. So now I have a funky fresh little bone here. I can eat some of my mutton because I'm going to move. But yeah, I, I was saying this earlier, but one of the cool things about doing a Minecraft series is that since the game is like pretty chill, it's not going to be entirely chill, but it's pretty chill. So I can kind of just talk about whatever the hell I want. Which, which one is my... Oh shit, I do not remember my controls. What is my shift key? Um, sneak is C. I must have done weird things with my controls. It's okay, I, I want this coal. I want this coal. Whoop, there, there goes my pickaxe. So, just take all of this coal, get the natural resources out of the ground, because that is how Minecraft works. You take everything. Oh, my, my computer lags like that sometimes. It's weird and bad and strange and bad because, you know, Horse manure. <gasps> Lava! It's not a pool like I was looking for. But it's lava.
pardon me as I'm doing this. This is this is a laptop, so I'm being very careful that I don't ever let go of shift. Or in this case, a uh, C. So my control scheme is very, very strange. Here, I'll, I can just like try to mine my way down. This is a dangerous game. Okay, I can, I can explore this a little later. So, talking about whatever the hell I want, what, for now, would that constitute? Oh, that is that is a smelly charm. Oh, that that is multiple smelly charms. I have not today, thank you, to this man. Yeah, get bent. Now I just need to kill the bean in the water. So shield up on the approach. And yeah, so I, I did that. There are there are a lot of mobs most likely here. But I think this this is gonna be like the lava that I get. That that little bit in this cave. I don't know who made it, probably someone who was on this surfer longer than I've been. But someone definitely did make this. Ugh. I keep distracting myself from this topic of just talking about whatever I wanna talk about at whenever I wanna talk about it. Yep, there, 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 you are me down there. There's an man over there. Don't typically like these sorts of things. Would rather find an overworld lava pool, but I don't really know if I can. Are you gonna be fine? Yes, you, you're gonna be fine. So, I'm, I'm very gradually scaling down this. Very gradually. See, I'm, I'm, I'm doing it again. I'm distracting myself from being able to talk about whatever the hell I want, whatever the hell I want to talk about it. Because I'm, I'm, I'm just bad at my job like that. So, wrong, wrong block. Um... Yes, I want to put it there, so that I can mine, mine, you're, you're not gonna cooperate with me because you're dead. Yep, there, there, there are most definitely mobs there. I do not like mobs. If I just had that lava that was already there, then... I could just placing that there so that I don't trip, fall, and die. Hmm. But uh Yeah, look at look at the very uneventful nature 
of me at this Minecraft server. I should go back and check up on the beef. I was cooking that beef a little bit before, but I haven't actually, like, checked on it. So yeah, goals, goals, goals. The goals are the nether. The nether is the goal. Two steaks got cooked there. Two steaks got cooked there. Nice. Actually, what I can do is... This spare plank. One stick. That cooks the two of those. Because that's pog. Now, what the hell is this? I saw recipes for, like, fudge and everything. It needs... Oh, the crossbow. It needs iron. It needs some string. It needs a tripwire hook. I do not know off the top of my head how tripwire hooks are created. Oh, I can make a tripwire hook like this. So I can make, I need, yeah, so if I make a tripwire hook, and I go to the wet holes, and I can make a crossbow. Alrighty, I, I, I know I like me some crossbows, so, I'll just leave, I'll just have that, so I'll have a crossbow and a shield. My, my iron is gone, so I've only got one bucket, but it's fine. It's fine, it'll be okay. What else was there to potentially create? That's a hopper, that's pressure plates. Lever, don't really need that. Don't need many doors or anything. I already have my bucket. Okay, so four rabbit hide can create a lever. That's kind of interesting. Didn't know that off the top of my head. You can make lanterns. Ooh, that's nifty. Okay. So, uh, because I feel like being done with, with a bunch of food, a bunch of coal, a leather helmet, and a goal, and a crossbow, because I like me some crossbows, I am just going to end this episode of the GPL SMP off here, um... Yeah, I don't know when I'll record the next one. My upload schedule is probably going to be hot garbage. But who knows? I might turn this into like a semi-daily thing, just uploading little bits of my work on the GPL SMP. I'm not going to progress as much as other people do as quickly because I'm doing it in this format. Just because I want to do other things with my time. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this sort of little bit of content I'm doing. But for now... This is episode one of the GPL SMP. I'm going to have to title this, aren't I? Well, project for a teeny bit later.